Hey guys, Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. So today, a couple things. Um, enter to win video for Bitcoin Fridays, day early. I'm going to be going over uh, my shared masternode situation and a card for sale. Be back in a bit. Okay, so like I said, Bitcoin Friday Enter to Win video is going to be today. Um, tomorrow's July 4th here in the U.S., so I won't be doing a video tomorrow. Um, so if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. Hit that bell icon below. Um, enter your BTC wallet address in the comments below. And uh, on this Friday, I will pick a winner. Simple as that. All right, guys? So with that, um, let's go and check out everything that's been going on and what I'm doing. All right, so by the way, uh, happy 4th of July early for those of you guys living here in the U.S. Um, should be hopefully a good day for everybody. All right, so let's go check out the Moondex master node. So this is the master node I'm on. And as you can see, we had a 2,500 uh, coin deposit to start it. And then every day so far has been getting 40 coins. Um, so the way I see it, I have two seats on this 20 seat master note. So if I do the calculations, I get paid every two weeks. So I'll show you that right here. Um, this is the uh, master note calendar. I'm a class B payout, which we would have got paid out on the first, but I think it started on Saturday, if I'm not mistaken. So they didn't pay out on the first because there's really no coins to pay out. So on the 15th, I should be getting a payout through this shared master node. So if we head back over here, pull up the calculator. So that's two weeks, basically. So 40 coins a day on average. Sometimes I think it goes up, you know, you can get anywhere from 40 to 60, but I think 40 is about the norm. So 40 times two weeks, which is 14, it's 560 coins. Since it's a 20-seater shared master note, I have two seats. I should be getting 10% of, uh, of the coins. So I would times that times 0 0.10. I should be getting on the 15th, 56 moon decks. And every two weeks going forward, I should be getting 56 coins every two weeks. 112 a week so how much is that at the moment it's not much um, but hopefully when it finally hits an exchange or two the value of that keeps going up there are 51 million moondex coins so you can kind of do some rough math if we go over to let me go here coin market cap Let's try and find a coin. Now, this is just wishful thinking here real quick. Um, there's what's to say Litecoin. It's 57 million coins. got a 4.9 billion market cap. Let's just say we're 10% of that, and it's a 490 million market cap. Um, in other words, when a coin finally hits an exchange, say its market cap is 490 million. So you could take four nine zero 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 zero, divide that by the number of total supply of coins, and this could give you a rough estimate of how much that coin would be worth if the total market cap is four hundred ninety million dollars, which is only ten percent of Litecoin. So we'd hit enter, that coin would be $9.60, which would be very nice. I'm total, totally uh, sitting on 343 coins right now. That would be $3,300. So let's just, let's just say it's only 1% um, of 4, 4, uh, 4 4.9 billion. So let's hit back for right there times 0 0.01. 49 million. So then you would divide that by the total supply. 
that would be 96 cents a coin, which still is not bad at all, times 343, $329. So that's kind of a, a rough way, very rough at that, of kind of seeing what a coin will be when it finally comes to market. Um, so if the coin does get a market cap of 49 million, which, I mean, I think that's realistic, we could be looking at a 96 cent coin. And I thought at the beginning when I first started mining this coin, uh, Moondex is, which is what it is on that master node, that it should be anywhere from 50 cents to a dollar. So with 1% of uh, a Litecoin, which is roughly the same amount, that's circulating supply, I know, but total supply of 51 million, 96 cents a coin, I'd be happy with that. And then I'm getting 56 coins uh, every two weeks. Let's pull this up again. It'll be 112 a month times 0.96. $107 a month passive income on that shared master node, 1200 a year. I'll take that. It's not bad. Uh, for an investment of about $170 to get those two seats. So I'll take it. So we'll see when it comes up to July 15th uh, what the actual payout is. Um, but my calculations are right. It should be about 56 coins. All right, so Gin Coin, I'm still mining that. Had an issue with the wallet earlier. So it went offline for a little bit, and I started mining NiceHash just until I figured out the wallet problem. Uh, I got that fixed, so I started mining it again. I'm only going to mine gin coin till I get just one gin coin, and I'll be done. Um, I just wanted to try this to see how profitable it was. I thought it might be more profitable than mining uh, nice hash at the moment, but it, it was close. But I think I get roughly about a dollar ninety a day doing gin coin. So nice hash is a little over two dollars for that rig. Which brings me to my next point. Um, this 1063 gig I have, which is this exact card right here, I'm going to be selling it because it's a 3 gig. I kind of knew when I bought it, I probably shouldn't have bought it because for future purposes. This card will not mine Ethereum. So when I'll pull up NiceHash and it'll actually start mining EquiHash, which now that all these ASICs are getting on there, um, it would say it's only like 30, I think I saw it, it was like 31 cents this card was doing because of the difficulty. Now, I don't know why um, it wasn't switching to a more profitable algorithm, but anyways, I'm going to be selling this card. If anyone is interested, uh, let me know in the remarks down below, as well as putting your BTC wallet address. Um, this is roughly what I paid for it. I'm not expecting to get that. Um, but I'd be happy with 200 bucks for this card. I've only been using it since March 18th is when I ordered it. So I got it roughly then. So is that March, April, May, June? Three and a half months I've been using this card, mining with it. Um, I don't overclock these cards. So I did a little bit here and there, but it's not overclocked right now. Anyways, um, so that's why I'm selling that card, because I want to be uh, get at least a 6 gig card. So when I sell this, I'm going to actually probably get another 1070 Ti and put it on there. Because you can get those over on NVIDIA right now for $449 still the last time I checked. Which is 1070 Ti I got now is running good. So, let's get into my uh, sheet here I just did get a payout of Bitcoin so now I'm sitting at 138.96 total value mined of $426.68 that's a nice jump over last week which we took a huge drop so we're pretty much back to where we were um, two weeks ago which was 428.18 I should surpass that this week uh, through mining gin coin that'll push that up sitting at 21.59 so so far this week um, 
I'll pass last week's 2312 for set week. I was experimenting on different things, so should be uh, should be a better week. Got a, still got a couple more days to mine, so this should be I'm guessing in the mid 30s by the time it's all said and done. Uh, so, anyways, guys. Um, Again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon below, spread the word about the channel. I'm um, getting close to 1,000 subscribers. When I hit 1,000, the uh, BTC, Bitcoin Fridays giveaway, will go up. So be sure to enter your Bitcoin wallet address in the comments below. And uh, good luck, guys. I will see you on Thursday's video. All right. Take care. Bye.